Hey, what's up everybody? Danny Lightning back with another CSR2 video. So, do you have a car when your your RPMs actually kick back to zero when you get a perfect launch and it slows you down? Generally, that means your tires have too much grip, and there's actually two different ways to fix this. Alright, please like, subscribe, and hit the little bell that notifies you when I make a new video. I always try and get back to everybody's questions when you ask questions in the comments, but I do get a lot of comments, and YouTube doesn't show me every comment, so sometimes I miss them. But watch what happens, alright? Watch what happens when I get a perfect launch here. This car will kick back to zero, and I'll run a lousy time. Three, two, one, go. See that? It kicked back to zero, and I'm going to run... A couple tenths of a second slower than I should be running so there's two ways to fix this number one is don't get a perfect start try and get a late start all right and number two is retuning your tires I'm gonna go ahead and show you both of these really quickly so first off I'm gonna show you the the non perfect start I want to launch, instead of launching right around 5,000 RPMs here, I want to launch around like somewhere between 6 and 7. So basically, I'm just going to let go of the gas later. On this car, this works really good. 3, 2, 1, go. See that? Right around 6,000 RPMs, I did my launch, and I didn't get that horrible kickback. So that's one way to fix it. On some cars, that works great. Now there's another way to fix it. There I got a 7.175. That's much better than the 7.571. <laughs> what? It's just the number is backwards, all right? I'm surprised that didn't mess up my dyslexia there. But check this out. Or number two is retune your tires. Like this car, if I go to around 11 PSI, I am going to be able to get a perfect start now and the car is not gonna give me this kickback. So this might be a good option for some cars. Try both options. Number one, don't get the perfect start. Number two, retune the tires. See which one works best for you if you're having the kickback problem and it's making your car slow. Now, for example, the Copo Camaro kicks back. That's the only car I know of that kicks back and you want that to happen. There might be a couple more, I'm not sure. Three, two, one, go. No kickback on that good start. Check that out. So those are basically the two ways to fix it. But yeah, there might be another car or two in the game where you actually want the kickback. I'm not sure. There I got a 7.180. But as far as I know, there's only, there's only a couple cars in the game maybe where you want the kickback. I know like some of my RX-7s have the kickback on a perfect start. Most of the time, I just do a late launch instead of getting the perfect start. Most of the time, I don't retune the tires. I just modify the way I start the car. Now, on this car, it actually seems to work better for me if I just retune the tires. Now, this car will run a 7.069, I think, completely maxed out. I think that's the fastest run on this so far. My understanding is if you retune the tires... You're never going to get better than like a 7, 7.120. You'll never hit that 7.0 time, but it makes the car easier to drive, and you're still going to get a really fast time on the car. So I personally, I think on this one, I'm just going to leave the tires at 11 PSI. Even though the car might run slightly slower, it's easier to get a faster time for me if I don't have that kickback for some reason. All right? This one's going to go in my tuning playlist that shows you how to tune for different things. And I'll probably put this one on my uh, regular guide slash tutorial playlist as well because I think this kind of fits in two different categories. And nope, you cannot open the doors on these Bugattis yet. Some people are saying it's because they haven't actually released what the interior or the engine or anything looks like on this car in real life yet. I don't know, maybe it's that, maybe it's a, just a glitch. I'm not 100% sure, but as of right now, we can't open the doors or the hood or the trunk or anything like that on this car. But yep, if you're having those kick, 
kickback problems those are two two of the different things you can try all right i think that pretty much wraps this video up and i will catch you guys later see ya